Developing tonight, city officials in Ravenna are accusing the Portage County Sheriff's Office of randomly dropping off recently released inmates in their city. New video shows police confronting one of them for stealing clothes off of scarecrows downtown because they say she was left overnight in the cold. Giovanni Legion reports. Why are you destroying stuff out here? Why are you taking part all these scarecrows? Police body camera video shows the moments after a woman took clothes off scarecrows during early morning hours. She had nowhere to go after being released from jail. Were you here all night or they just dropped you off this morning? After all night. She tells officers the Portage County Sheriff's Office left her there the night before and there was a reason she needed the clothes. She was taking all the clothes off of that because she was cold. Ravenna city officials say this is just one example of an ongoing problem. They say the sheriff's department drops the released inmates off at night, adding that those releases oftentimes happen when resources are closed. You're putting our business owners at risk. You're putting um, our residents at risk and you're putting these people at risk because you're setting them up for failure before they even have an opportunity to get out. Councilwoman Amy Michael said she's tried to coordinate the drop offs and adds that the sheriff's office doesn't respond to her or other officials. She shows me where Ravenna police found the woman left in the cold. It's disheartening. It's cruel. It's inhumane. I am finding, you know, people, myself, um, community members, our police officers, um, they're being released from jail at times when our local transportation is not available. They're also being released when there is no resources open, there is nothing um, around for them to get. We watched the video with a local resident who expressed her frustration. It's really sad that that poor woman was running around taking clothes off of our scarecrows to keep warm instead of him doing the littlest amount of do that he could have done is call somebody. And local nonprofit director Rodney Mack agrees, explaining that he hopes the community can solve this issue. We have to have love. We got to start moving with love and compassion. You know, other people is not fortunate as others. You know, you, and it does take a village to raise a child. And we tried to get in touch with the Portage County Sheriff's Office, but nobody responded to our requests for comments. The body camera video shows that Ravenna police took the woman back to Akron instead of charging her for taking the clothes off of the scarecrows.